day is something far more intense than life itself. There is something that makes your life the meaning of life, and you will understand. If not, then let me confuse you even more. There are some people who don't understand. Ignorant people. People with no passion for the underground. And maybe they just care about money. Or such other simple boring things. These single minded people. People who are maybe thinking. That it's just a black and white thing for whatever stupid reason. These people are just breathing the air that we provide. They won't know how to make their own. You know what I mean? So now I think it's about time that we release ourselves and let them suffocate. Otherwise, we will most definitely die. Do you understand?
would like to play a little tune I just composed not so long ago.
later. Um, but probably not too different. What about the seven years? Probably a little bit more crowded and polluted than the five years. What about in ten? I think in 10 years things will be starting to look like the aesthetic will have changed. Things That'll have been, be 2010. Yeah, things will be different shapes, but I don't think life's going to be too different in 10 years. 20? 20 years, I think things are going to be different in the way we use technology and the way that the way that we communicate with each other is going to be getting, going to be changing more dramatically after 20 years. And what about five years after that, so 25 years? Yeah, I think technology is going to be pretty awesome by then. I think we're going to be maybe communicating in a completely different way that hasn't been thought of so far. I think that the main, yeah, I think the main difference is going to be the information, how information is passed between people. Maybe, maybe we'll have developed some form of non-verbal communication by then. So, if you look back 25 years earlier to now, do you think it's changed that dramatically that it will leap again? 25 years from now? Oh, it'll leap more so. I think we're, we live in an accelerating culture. The rate of change is speeding up all the time. The difference between now and 25 years' time is going to be far more dramatic than the difference between 25 years ago and now. And do you think it's apocalyptic after 2000? No, 2000 is just a number that we, that we decided on. It doesn't mean anything. It's just a nice round figure for a good party. Okay, what about 35 years? 35 years. 10 years on from the acceleration, 25. I don't know, I think, well, I'm going to be around. It's going to be, things are maybe going to be starting to get quite scary then. In 35 years, that's long enough for the, the population to be much bigger than it is now. Right, now, what's life in the world going to be like in 50 years? 2050. In 2050? You'll be... I'm going to be old. 70 something. I'm going to be, yeah, I'm going to be in my 70s. Well, I hope it's going to be nice and peaceful, but I don't think it will be. Uh, I don't know, people are probably going to be listening to some pretty damn slamming music by then. Um, I just want to know what the kids will be listening to when I'm 70. What a thought. So if we listen to the music that our grandparents listen to, it seems so square. So. <laughs> I just want to see what kids are going to be dancing to when I'm 70. I think that's going to be fun. I don't know, it's going to be, I have a feeling it's going to be faster, and I don't know, I, I, think, I think life's going to be less natural, I think we're going to move, we're going to, we're going to move further and further away from, from the natural world, we're going to be living you know, in more of an abstract way from nature, we're going to be, we're going to be probably eating less and less natural foods, and eating more and more sort of engineered foods, that probably so sort of we'll need to save space with growing stuff. Indoors, hydroponic, that sort of thing. No fields, you know, it'll all be taken over by too many buildings and things. Like, cars are going to be fast. If, we can, if we're still allowed to drive cars, they're going to be fast in 70 years. Do you think 70 years ago, cars were really slow? <laughs> in 70 years' time, they're going to be hauling. They're going to be really moving. That, that's going to be kind of interesting. I don't know. I don't know. About 100 years. In 100 years? Do you think the world will be recognisable to people now? Will it be recognisable? I don't think I don't think separate cities and separate towns are going to exist anymore. I think it's just going to be a huge metropolis. Or maybe 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 in a hundred years they'll start moving people out to space. You know, maybe we'll maybe we'll have managed to colonise some other parts of the solar system by then. And, you know, and some people will be able to move off Earth, whether they whether they want to or not. I don't know. Maybe maybe it'll be like a Instead of having rich parts of town and poor parts of town, you'll have like rich planets and poor planets. And it'll be just the really rich people that can afford.